As soon as I did it, I just go, it happened again. Oh my goodness. Yes! That's yes. how you get her done up here in Manitoba. What are we doing today? Not many people can say they've done this and accomplished it. But we're gonna accomplish it today, folks. Morning, guys. Get some light. Today we're headed north into the Nopaming, trying to get smallies through the ice. It'll take a lot of work, but if we find them, I think it's gonna be really good. I'm excited to try something new. We haven't had great fish in the last two days, but sometimes you gotta swing for the fence, which is what we're doing. Um, we got about a two hour drive, and then we'll pop holes for eight hours. We just spent 20 minutes of our lives at Clark's Corner in Pine Falls. We didn't get chicken and wedges, which is one of the main reasons you should stop here, but they didn't have any made yet. Yeah, um, I don't know. What'd you get? I got some sausage sticks. Show me your sausage sticks. We've been driving for two hours. We're almost there. It's gonna be a pretty good day. Minus 10 and not windy. So I guess we drill 200 holes today and find them stacked in the last hole. In the last, in 200 of 200. We made it, we made it. We got a big day ahead of us, drilling a lot of holes. This guy is gonna be drilling most of them. Am I right? How many holes have you drilled in your life? Like 40? Uh, maybe 35. Okay, he's gonna double his lifetime hole count today. Would you get a little closer? All right, here's the game plan. Two guys on drills, two guys the flashers, and we're gonna try to find these fish. We're starting on some main lake structure, and then we'll go to some islands points, see what else we can do. Spot number two. We're looking for that deeper water, but we might have to start fishing shallower stuff. But we're gonna keep drilling. I'll, I'll drill if you wanna check, Brett. Was it? Oh, oh, that's it. That might be. That's a small. Small. Yes! 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 yes, dude. That's a good one. Really? Yeah. He's so close to the camera. Really? Can I drop down? Yeah, you should drop down here. All right. We found some fish. We dropped the camera down and saw two smallies and a walleye all in a short order. So this lake is shallow. The deepest we've seen is 11 feet. We saw the fish in 10 feet on mud, so I, I think if they're on mud, they're probably cruising a little bit more. Um, we're gonna try where that rock meets the rud. We'll try, eh. we'll try where that mud meets the rock. We're gonna drill the side of this island and see if we can get going. What do we got? What do we got? Oh, for sure. oh yeah. Come on. First smallie? First smallie. He's at the hole. Oh, come on. Looks like a pike. Oh, it's cutting. Not a pike. Oh! It's a freaking good right! Yeah! Didn't take long. There we go. Look, Look at, at that. that. That is awesome. Hair jig. Yep, man. Good job. There we go. Oh, a little was... turkey action. <laughs> that was awkward. That was so awkward. <laughs> there we go. That's sweet. There we go. Boom. Look at that guy. Smallmouth through the ice. A small, smallmouth. Awesome. 
Beauty, hey? I wasn't using a stinger hook, so I'm a bit of an idiot, but uh, you know, he, he was so aggressive, I didn't even need it. See you, buddy. Go. Alex. Yeah. Are they biting pretty good with that on? I just had a big mark. Do they like that on? What on? On. Good one. Good one. Love this. This is insane. This is some of the coolest, coolest fishing for sure. You have the hole? No, not yet. <sighs> Guys, I cannot even tell you what it's like to catch smallmouth through the ice. They're just ripping drag on little bluegill jigs. That's what we're using right now. I got my boy Sammy D gonna help me land this fish. Oh, this is a good one. This dude. is a good fish. Jay, I got a good one. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. There you go. Oh yeah. A 16 incher. Two pounder all day long. And look at that bait I'm using. Just a small bluegill jig with a little bit of plastic. And that right there is a Manitoba smallmouth. <laughs> They say, lift it and hold it. The fish are eating when it's dead sticked. Here we go, is it coming back? I haven't caught a bass yet, the other guys have been lighting them up. I switched to a smaller bait, I, I kept a big bait on way too long. Ooh, that feels good. Ooh, ooh, that feels good. Oh, pull and drag. This is a tiny jig, so I'm gonna take my time. Woo! It's a good fish. Oh! Come on, baby. Oh! Oh, he popped off! Nice! Another good bass. Awesome. That one was on the little panfish jig. It's a good sign. That is a good sign. I held that right in front of his face. Normally, you'll keep the jig a little bit above. The fish is marking there, you'll keep it a little bit above his head because they're normally going to feed up. But that fish, I dropped the jig down right in front and he just eventually got angry at it and ate it. Tides are turning. Back in the game. I don't know about his rod grip right now. It's questionable. Do you actually have a big mark? Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, this is a good fish. This is good. Oh, oh, oh. Come on. <laughs> Seven foot of water, dude. That's fighting hard. The shallowest hole drag, yet. Yeah. There's problems with my drag going on. Oh my goodness. Yeah, there's there's, there's lots of problems. This is a good fish. There's lots of problems. <laughs> oh! You just break off? No, wow. Is this thing gonna eat it or you're just gonna look at it? Yes. Oh, 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 -hoo. thank you. Oh, this feels good. Look at how dark that fish That's is. A big one. Wow. That's a big one, dude. That is a nice one. Right on. Heck yeah, thank you. Deadly. That might be the biggest, longest fish of the day. Awesome day. We got lucky, but without a camera, I don't know if we would have seen those or found those fish. Yeah, that was key. The fish were cruising. They weren't like smallies that I expected to be hunkered down on a wintering spot. They were almost roaming this rock edge, just, I mean, around the island. So with the camera, we saw a couple fish in the distance, started fishing, and these fish were, they acted different, but hovering the bait in their face seemed to be the deal. 
not moving it and uh, we got bit, so. Thank you for watching. If you're not subscribed, I'm, I'm, you're probably subscribed already, but if you're not by some chance, AP Bassin, check it out. Make sure you're following these guys on Instagram. I'll link them all. Thanks for watching. Well, you thought the video was over, but it's not over because we're with Alex Perrick, who's known for some pretty good stunts. I did the same thing before. What happened? <laughs> Are you parked on the shoulder? <laughs> Dude, okay, I, I, got, I got to pull over. Dude, as soon as I did it, I just go, it happened again. Oh my goodness. Could you, did you guys think you were going to flip? Uh, it was, it was. Okay, well, there. I, I thought oh, for I a second, yeah, that. but it happened so quick that That's we were just steep. down. Holy smokes. Oh, is it steep? You think if I, and it, we are in the middle of nowhere. Steep and deep. Look at this. Unload the trailer. Unload. Oh my goodness. As soon as I did it, I just go, I did it again. And the funny part is, is we're on a Sunday in the middle of nowhere, Canada, and I did this once before. This is, I've gotten into two accidents in my life. This is considered an accident. I've drove off the ditch twice. Both in Canada, both when I'm tired after a full day of fishing. Well, we got the, we, we're actually making progress. We might get the trailer out, and the truck is next, but we still have to get the trailer out. <laughs> and I'm an idiot, still. But we love him. We love Alex. Okay, we're trying this. Stop a little bit. Just go slow. Go slow. Get crazy. We did one thing. Surprise. We got it. Alex behind the wheel. Ooh. A plan has been formulated. Well, that was kind of one of our plans. The plan was either tow out or give her, and giving her wasn't working, so we're gonna tow him out. Okay, start slowly going, Jay. Come on, baby. Give her, Come give on, her, baby. give her, Jay. Damn, son! Yeah! Ow, ow! Boys! Yes! That's yes. how you get her done up here in Manitoba. Before you just don't drive in the ditch like a freaking idiot. <laughs> Good job. I mean, not on hitting the ditch, but getting out. <laughs> nice work, boys.